What's going on guys, my name's Caffrey. Today I got a short video for you on how to install the R5 Reloaded and Flow State Aim Trainer Automatic Updater Tool. Now if you don't have R5 Reloaded or the Flow State Aim Trainer mod installed, check out my complete guide right here to get that up and running and then come back to this video. Now I'm making this video because installing this can be a little intimidating to some people and some of my friends because you have to go to the GitHub to get the application and then when you open it, you're greeted with command prompts inside of a terminal. Hmm? But it's actually super easy, so let's get started. So the first thing we need to do is head over to the GitHub. The link will be in the description. And under Assets, you want to download this first one that says R5Util. Now that we have it downloaded, we're going to extract the files using WinRAR. And now we're just going to drag the executable file right here over to our R5 Reloaded folder. And it has to be in the same folder as R5 Reloaded. Now we can go ahead and close out WinRAR. And all you're going to do is double click to launch the uh, executable and you'll be greeted with this uh, this terminal with these command prompts. And it's pretty simple and straightforward. They do a good job of giving you some easy instructions to follow. All you're gonna do is use the arrow keys to kind of navigate through these boxes and hit spacebar to either select or deselect what you wanna update or install. By default, the SDK and the latest flow state scripts are pre-selected, which is all I'm gonna do. Um, but if you're having issues with R5 Reloaded or anything like that, you might wanna go ahead and try the troubleshooting one. And then we're just gonna go ahead and press enter. As you can see, it's just gonna download and update the files for you right away. Now make sure you don't exit out of this until you get the confirmation that it's done installing. So now we can go ahead and close it, fire up R5 Reloaded, make sure everything's good to go. Just a reminder, you do have to have the EA or Origin app open for this to launch. And we're in, everything's good to go. All the servers are available. Let's just make sure the aim trainer launches. And it looks like we're in. As you can see, we got two new tasks in the aim trainer, so we know these are the latest files. And that's pretty much it. If you guys have any questions for me, leave a comment down below. If this video helped you out, hit that like button for me and subscribe for more first person shooter content.